Is a pizza ever too cheesy? These are the questions we must ask ourselves. YouTube channel. Last week, Caribbean Passion challenged me and a few other Jamaican food bloggers to the Cooking with Passion Passion Pizza Challenge. Now, before we get into that, make sure that you like, subscribe, and share this video with all of your friends because a bag of things are going to Yeah? Yeah. Let's get back into it. Caribbean Passion blessed me with this bag of goodies. Yes. Amazing. Let's see what's inside. So we got the crust. Yes. Spanish chorizo sausage. Corn pork. Mm. Smoked chub ham. I'm all about the ham. I love it. Sorry for anybody who don't eat pork out there. This is not for you. Jamaican jerk sausage. Streaky bacon. Love that for breakfast. Hickory smoked sliced ham. Pepperoni sausage. Spicy pepperoni sausage to be exact. All right, so Caribbean Passion only challenged us to make one pizza, but we endorsed the Wonga God here. So today I'm making two. I'm going to make one really traditional meat lovers. I'm gonna call it the Caribbean Passion meat extravaganza pizza, meat explosion pizza. And then the other one is going to be not so traditional. It may even be controversial. Will you cancel me after watching this video? Maybe, but that's fine. That's not fine. Um, but we're gonna do it anyway. The first pizza that we're going to make is an aki and corn pork pizza. Yes. Um, because we got the corn pork, and I personally have never cooked with corn pork before, but we also had some leftover aki in the freezer and I was like corn pork aki Why not? So here's what goes into my aki Tomato, onion, garlic, scallion, scotch bonnet, black pepper, thyme, salt Easy peasy, I'll put the recipe down below in case you need it All right, so now that we have our aki ready, um, let's get to assembly. So this is the pre-made crust that Caribbean Passion gave me. You can always buy pre-made crusts in the supermarket. I tend to find mine in Mega Mart, but you can find them in almost any supermarket around. It usually already comes with the tomato sauce on it. Sometimes it will even come with cheese already on it. You do you boo. But you can also make your own pizza dough. Google is free, so you can definitely look up your own recipe for pizza dough. You know, there's gluten-free pizza dough, there's vegan pizza dough, there is pizza dough all over the place. If you want to stay true to Wonga Gal, be sure to head to my Instagram page under my story highlights in Qua Recipes for my anything in the fridge pizza which gives you a no rise pizza recipe so it doesn't use any yeast it doesn't need any rest time and it's vegan because i used almond milk but of course you don't need to use that so yeah head over there if you want to make your own pizza dough all right so everywhere. Okay, 
ackee everywhere. Um, of course, if you put other things in your ackee, as I said, do you go? That's fine. This is just my recipe that I always use. And now it's time for the corn pork. So, oh, we just sprinkle that everywhere. And there you have it. All right, so into the oven we go. So I forgot to put the extra onions and the sweet pepper on the pizza. So here I am sprinkling down now. I actually usually put sweet pepper in my ackee when I'm making just ackee. So I thought why not just top them on the pizza. Alright, so now that the ackee and corn pork pizza is in the oven. While we wait on... <laughs> see how that turns out let's get started on the second pizza which is what i'm gonna call the meat extravaganza caribbean passion meat extravaganza pizza copyright that okay so this is a pre-made crust that i bought at the supermarché and as you can see it already has some tomato sauce on it but i'm gonna put some more just for some freshness now this is a tomato sauce that Caribbean Passion gave to me to participate in this Passion Pizza Challenge. But usually when I'm making pizza at home, which I do often, if you follow Wang Yell on Instagram, you will know that I make pizza, homemade pizza very often. And I usually make my own pizza sauce, which is really just like a combination of tomato paste fresh tomatoes uh what else do i put in there if i have like leftover salsa i'll put salsa in there and then i just put all the seasonings in there i'll put some oregano i'll put some basil i'll put some thyme um if i have garlic i'll roast some garlic and put that in there i'll even put some olive oil in there too just literally just blend everything in your blender like anything that you think is going to taste good just blend that all up in your blender and that's how i usually make my own tomato sauce then we're going to do the meat explosion okay so let's start off with I think this is the pepperoni because you know pepperoni on pizza why not um and then put in some chorizo some of this lovely lovely chorizo i think this is the chorizo as well as the jerk sausage yes so i think already on here we have the pepperoni the chorizo sausage as well as the jerk sausage all right so now we're gonna just sprinkle on a mixture of the chub ham and the corn pork all right just all of that all of that and of course guys remember to enter the passion pizza competition it's for everyone to enter and you know it's so fun all you have to do is just make a pizza and ensure that you're using a Caribbean passion item in the pizza. That's really all. It's so simple, so easy. All right, cool. Meaty. All right, now, I don't care what you have to say. We're dropping some pineapple on this pizza. If you don't like pineapple on pizza, I don't really care. That's fine. <laughs> um, but I like pineapple on pizza. And given the amount of meat on this, I think adding some, you know, freshness, uh some sweetness will be nice it will cut into all of the meaty craziness on this pizza right here and then we got the cheese cheese is so necessary i believe this is parmesan cheese caribbean passion sent it to me as well but you know, in general, I like using a mixture of cheeses. I will literally just put any cheese that I have in the fridge. Cheddar cheese, white cheese, Parmesan cheese, mozzarella cheese, Gouda. Like, give me all the cheeses. I literally have made pizza with brie as well. Like, I love cheese. So, just any cheese that you have, you know. Even if it's vegan cheese. Find some vegan cheese and pop it on a pizza. 
All right. Voila. We are ready. And there you have it guys, my official entries to the Caribbean Passion Cooking with Passion Passion Pizza Challenge. Alright, let's try this one. Oof. Passion Pizza. Blah, blah, Good. <laughs> wow. Wow. Let me tell you, when the aki comes in contact with like the tomato sauce from the crop, wow. Wow. And the corn pork. I'm speechless. It was so good. I didn't expect it to be that good. Yeah. Aki and corn pork pizza. Only thing is, you know, like the toppings are obviously falling off because it didn't have like, you know, cheese is usually like the binding agent. But this is good. This is amazing. Okay, I'm corn pork pizza. Heard it here first. Wow, girl. Yeah. 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 All right, on to the next one. It is my meat extravaganza. We're gonna get a cheese pull. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's right. Whoa, man, it's so good. <laughs> oh, wow, I'm the fresh pineapple. Sorry, I'm talking with food in my mouth, guys, but mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, 10 out of 10. Mm. Caribbean passion, cooking with passion, passion pizza challenge. Guys, guys, yes, my pizzas were awesome. They were. But just remember that the best pizzas are the pizzas with passion. That's all you need to make a pizza good. Passion. Nothing else. Once your heart is in it, it will be amazing. All right, guys, remember that bag of goodies that Caribbean Passion gave to me? Well, you can have one for yourself. It can all be yours if you just enter the Passion Pizza competition. Now, all you have to do is ensure that you're following Caribbean Passion JA on Instagram. Then make one of your beautiful Passion Pizzas. Post the picture on Instagram and ensure that the picture has the packaging of the product that you use. You have to use at least one Caribbean Passion product. It could be anything of your choosing, at least one. You want the packaging in the photo, you want to post it, you want to tag Caribbean Passion, you want to use all the hashtags. I will have all the hashtags in the description below. And my fave, Chef Card will be choosing two winners on October 4. So use that passion and make those pizzas, guys. And remember to always cook with passion. Yes. Mm -hmm.